has spent years waiting for this moment, an opportunity to become the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion. He has cashed in his Champion Series opportunity, and he did it with plenty of notice. He wanted everybody to know when and where he was going after Matt Cardona. The C word, Joe, the C word. But anyways, this crowd is hot for Pope as everyone in the NW arena on their feet, ready to see Pope in action beat Mr. C word. I know who you're rooting for. No question. <laughs> is it that obvious? So am I. Oop. And here comes the champion. Ladies and gentlemen, you may have noticed Tim Storm is not joining us here on the commentary table. Matt Cardona has demanded after what happened at the Crockett Cup, Tim Storm is not allowed, not only in the NWA arena, but not allowed in the building at all. He had to completely leave this entire property. Ridiculous. I think he's scared of Tim Storm, to be honest with you. Tim Storm is NWA. And for him to just waltz in here making demands like that? I mean, it's exactly what we expect to see from Mr. C-Word, as you thank like to put it. You, thank you, Joe. And this crowd is showing no love. Because nobody likes him. All right, let's head over to Kyle Davis for the introductions. The following match is our main event. It is an NWA World's Heavyweight Championship match. Introducing first, the challenger. Weighing in at 230 pounds from Jacksonville, Florida, this is the Pope! And he is the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion, weighing in at 232 pounds. From Long Island, New York, he is always ready. He is Matt Cardona! Boy, the people love him, huh? Think about everything Matt Cardona has done. But first, we gotta get a reading of the rules. Here's our referee for this matchup. Rules? He doesn't follow rules. Well, Scott Wheeler's gonna go over them anyways. And now, Scott Wheeler? with the rules. Gentlemen, please join me in the center. This match is for the NWA World's Heavyweight Championship. As you know, this championship can only change hands via pinfall or submission. I spoke to each of you individually in the back and gave you the rules for the match. I expect you to have a good, clean match and obey my commands at all times. Please back into your neutral corners and await the ringing of the bell. The bell has rung, and can the Pope live his dream of becoming the NWA World's Heavyweight Champion, while at the same time getting an ultimate taste of retribution after what Matt Cardona did to him at hard times, too? I would say yes to both of those questions, Joe. Absolutely. Pope has everything that it takes to be champion. You may remember back at hard times, too, Matt Cardona sending the skull of the Pope into the steel steps, leading to a massive concussion, putting Pope on the, on the disabled list for several weeks. Pope is at, I would say, more than 100%. Oh, yeah. He is ready for this match. He's been ready for Matt Car The C word, man. Yes. So you caught yourself there. Yeah, I did. Cardona, looking for a break, grabbing the top rope. Oh, but he's such a crybaby. Pope is not backing down. He is ready. You know, Pope hasn't had a whole lot of conversations with us about what happened with Matt Cardona at this point. Beautiful headlock take over there. But we know that Pope is laser focused. I did have a chance to talk to him in the back earlier. One count there. 
Yes. First pin attempt of the matchup. But Matt Cardona staying locked in. I had a chance to talk to Pope as he once again goes through the cover, gets a two count. Pope said he's not going to let his emotions get the best of him. He's going to be cool, him. calm, and collected. I believe that Pope is the type of person where he does not let his emotions get the best of him. He's a great friend of mine. I've known him for, my gosh, well over a decade. And if it's one thing Pope doesn't do, it's let his emotions take over his focus. And you know what's interesting is I, during that conversation I had with Pope, he said before Matt Cardona was Matt Cardona when people knew him as Zack Ryder when he had his first match in the WWE. It was an unsuccessful match against a man who went by the name Elijah Burke. Ah, okay. So I think that Matt Cardona still has a, a grudge, against a chip Elijah on his shoulder, Burke. Yeah. now known as the Pope. Don't do it, Pope. You're smarter than this. <sighs> the old Long Island salute to the face of Cardona. Big shoulder tackle. Cardona feeling that though as he grabs his mouth. Nice hip toss by the Pope. Holding on to that arm. Wasting no time at all. Atomic drop. Takes the leg out, drops oh, the fist. A series of moves. Go Pope. And Cardona's looking for a break. He's looking for a timeout. This is where Pope's got to be real careful. Doesn't want to get baited in by Cardona. He likes to take his time on the outside and frustrate an opponent. But Pope is standing his ground, center of the ring. Just get back in the ring, champ. Come on, champ. You can see the damage that's been done to his job. Yeah, but there's no crying in wrestling. Come Pope on. is an undefeated Golden Glove boxer. No one hits harder than the Pope, but a kick to the midsection shuts down Pope. Backs him into the corner. Cardona now applying pressure, choking the life out of the Pope, cutting corners, possibly getting real close to being disqualified. Now pie facing the Pope. One of the disrespects. Stiff forearm. To the, oh my gosh, another one. You know what? I told myself tonight, Joe, that I was not going to get hot and go off on Cardona, but I just cannot help it. Every time he is in front of me, I loathe him more and more, and tonight is probably the most I've loathed him since he's been here. He's a coward, like I said. He's a crybaby. He runs away from the fight. He has to cheat. I, I, just, just stop me. Shut me down anytime, because I really, really can no, just no, go I, on I, and on I, I and on. Want you to, oh, he's coming for the steps. He's do coming for the steps again. Don't you dare do that Don't you do it. Don't you, do, do, it. Pope. Don't you do that. That's what incapacitated no. the Pope. Get him, Pope. Oh, the, the brakes on. 12 to 6, elbow. How dare he even attempt that again. And then comes yeah. Pope flying through the air, coming down hard with a clothesline. And Cardona has collapsed on the concrete. Get him, Pope. Scott Get Wheeler him. up to a count of six. Pope knows that the title is on the line if he wants to win the championship. He cannot get counted out. Up on the apron, here comes Cardona. Needs a shoulder to the midsection. But oh, beats him oh with a knee. Oh, my gosh. That was brutal. Knee connected with the side of the face of Pope. Pope's just got to be careful, too, because that concussion that he suffered, you know, at the mercy, at the hands of Matt Cardona from that steel step. Oh, oh and just gets. He's got to protect his head a little bit more. And now Cardona looks like he's happy to take a count out victory. Joe, I think, okay, Pope was holding his head. It kind of had me concerned for a minute, but he seems to be okay. He seems to try to be shaking it off a little bit, but. I'm a little concerned right now. And you can hear the oh. chance of the crowd here at the NWA Arena. Come on, Pope, get back in there. Just watch it back when you do, because he doesn't give you any breathing room. Cardona just, oh, he just doesn't fight fair. He doesn't fight fair at all. Cardona now using the ropes, choking the life out of the Pope. Pope's got nowhere to go. I mean, if you're a champion, wouldn't 
you want to be like an honorable champion? What do you want to be known as an honorable champion, especially here in the NWA? And once again, using the T-shirt, using that T-shirt as a weapon. Exactly what the NWA does not Choking stand for. Everything Matt Cardona is about is the complete opposite of what the NWA stands for. I feel like the damage may have been done after choking him with the rope, but then with that T-shirt. And all Cardona, all he cares about are clicks. Him and his clicks. Big neck breaker there from the champion. Kick out Pope. One count on the Pope. And now, trying to rip the head from the shoulders. Every time I see the neck in that position in the ring, it, it, it makes my whole body cringe. The pressure it puts on your neck and shoulders, your head is not meant to be in that position. And now Cardona trying to put the Pope to sleep. As the Pope now gets to his feet. Trying to fight out of this hold now. Double shots to the midsection. Sends Cardona into the corner. Nobody oh, home. Pope. Oh. Pope went hard into that turnbuckle, has completely collapsed in the center of the ring. Pope really needs to rally. He's got to get back in this matchup if he wants to become the world's heavyweight champion. Just like his heroes, just like Harley Race, just like Dusty Rhodes, just like Ric Flair. As Cardona is given the one finger salute to the fans here at the NWA Arena. I'm getting concerned about Pope because he's still down from that. I mean, you saw him earlier Where's he going? holding his head. Now he's staying down, pretty lifeless in the ring. I'm a little worried about him. Cardona slowly making his way to the top turnbuckle. Okay, here we go. He's but back Pope, up. Pope is right back up. I think Pope was playing possum. Boom! See ya! Big superplex! Both men are down! This could come down to who gets to their feet first. Who can capitalize? I wish Pope had enough energy right now to just roll him over and cover him and beat him one, two, three. Pope deserves that championship. These people know it. Listen to them. Scott Wheeler up to the count of six. Both men starting to stir, reaching out for the ropes, looking for a little help to get to their feet. Cardona makes it to his feet first. Pope fighting from underneath. At least he's fighting. He's never gonna stop, oh. he's never gonna quit. Not after what Cardona did to him, and not after what Cardona has been doing to the NWA. Oh. Big clothesline from Pope. Back elbow now. Pope is feeling it. Shoot and a reverse. All right, Pope, keep that fire going, baby. Pope has found a second win. He is in fuego. He is certainly like he's in. stalking him now. He's in the zone. 12 to 6 elbow. This is what I like to see right here. Put him in his place, Pope. Teach him some respect. He's all lined up. Boom! Oh! Putting all of his weight behind that. Hanging Cardona out to dry as Pope now. Looking for a big maneuver to come off the top rope. He wants to but, win the championship. Card but Cardona's too Cardona. now. And Pope flies in the air. Beautiful. Cover, cover. This could be it. New champ. Oh, oh two count. So close, Pope. Two count on Cardona on this massive main event matchup on NWA Power. The heavyweight championship hangs in the balance. Has Cardona up on his rope. Breaking his the eyes. Oh. No. This is what I mean. It's never a good, clean fight with but him. But an STO. STO into the cover. Hook in the leg. Two count on Cardona. Cardona's like a cockroach. He just won't die. But here comes the big boot of the Pope to try to stomp out oh. this cockroach, as you put it. Yeah. Good replacement C word. Is what, yeah. Matt There's Cockroach. plenty of C words I can use to describe Cardona, but it's not really appropriate for the show. So I'll put Cardona that to might be out, though. He's shown very little signs of life no. as he now he's start, soon, starting Joe. to get to his feet. Oh, he was playing oh, awesome. Thrusts. Again, targeting the neck of the Pope like he was earlier in the match. Big boot. Cardona now on the middle rope. Yeah. What a drop 
kick. Look at the dash, the Pope's dreams here, and Pope kicks out. Nope. Come on. Come on. Oh. Oh. Ah. Come on. Pope, when I think of Pope, when I look at Pope, he is all muscle and all heart. Always has been. He's such a great friend of mine. He's a great person. He's an incredible athlete. I just can't, the list goes on and on. I can't say enough good things about him. And then you have the complete opposite in Matt Cardona. Absolutely despicable for what he's done. What he says about the NWA, what he says about this brand, then the history and the legacy and the tradition. Pope stands for that. Pope is fighting for that as much as he's fighting for himself. As these two trade blows center of the ring, a poke to the eye, a poke to the eye by Cardona. Shoulder tackle, takes down Pope. I just want to know how you just waltz into the NWA, disrespect everything about the NWA, and then become champion. Spine buster. Are we going to see it? Can he lock it in? Come on, baby. Turn around. Come on. He's trying. He's Come trying. On. He's got him. Get him on the belly. That's him. it. Shop shooter. Shop shooter. This is going to be it. We're going to have a new champion. Out, He's so baby. deep. He's so deep in the sharp shooter. Cockroach cry, baby. Cardone now. And Come now, on, Pope. Pope. Come on. Don't let him get the Will he ropes. tap again? Don't Will he tap? Go. Will he tap just like he did to Nick Aldis at the Crockett Cup? Pull Will he tap away. here? Pull him away, Pope. Pull him away from the ropes. Get him away from the ropes. Go, go, go. Transitioning there into the cross face. Oh, into the cross face. Still trying to make Cardona capitulate in the center of the ring here at the main event. I think he might tap out. The There's championship no is on the line. No, no, no. He's so close. Oh, he got the rope. Pope not nope, letting he's go. Not letting go. I don't blame him one bit. Let go before the five count, though. Pope's got to be thinking, what do I need to do? There's definitely damage done to Cardona right now. Pope is Between both of those holds, yeah. Cardona staying in the ropes. Scott Wheeler has to tell Pope to back off, give the separation, and here it comes. Oh, oh, my, God. oh my gosh! Sets Pope flying through the air. This might be no. it. No. Oh, oh wow. my gosh, I thought for a minute that was three. All of Pope's weight went crashing into the knees. I think that took all he had left after that move to kick out of that, and I, I just hope he can continue this match. And yeah, this crowd has not forgotten what happened at the Crockett Cup. Always tapping Matt Cardona. Instead of always ready, always tapping. Cardona trying to put Pope on the shoulders. Transition German. And he's holding on. He's holding on to the German like he wants to hold on to the 10 pounds of gold. Like he One wants more. to hold on to Sweet Charlotte. Three like he amigos, wants to hold baby. on to the greatest prize oh. in the sport of professional wrestling. Doesn't get to hit the third. Perhaps he does now. Oh, there he goes. Big release German suplex. And the Pope is feeling it. These people love Pope. They want to see the ch title change hands. Pope, you can't waste time here, baby. Go up top. Go, they go, want to go, witness go. history. These Pope, seconds are crucial. You Pope is go. on the precipice, go. but now oh. Cardona. Cardona goes into the ropes. Pope falls to the canvas, and no. He's got a target now. Looking to hit the reboot. He missed. He missed the reboot, and he came in hard. He came in hard on that bottom rope. Boom. That's four upside your head, Cardona. He's, oh, he's got the knee, no. the knee pads are down. Here he's looking for the Elijah Express. The same move that he beat Cardona with years and years ago. Come on, let's go, Pope. Let's go. Come on, baby. Get oh, he's got Scott go. Wheeler. He used Scott Wheeler to this block him. This is what him. I think. Oh, Pope to the eye. Power. A Pope Power. to the eye.
Wizard of Oz. Was it Cardona that played the role as the cowardly lion? Because that's all he oozes. He's a coward. He can never win a match clean. He, all, his tactics are disgusting. His disrespect is disgusting. His clicks are disgusting. He's disgusting. Velvet, Velvet, I know you're heartbroken. Oh. I am too. Thank you so much for joining us here on NWA Power. We will see you on Saturday for NWA USA. We love you, Pope.